Welcome back to Straight from the Hanging Pits and in the studio we've got a very special and talented musician from Wellington. It's Esther, how are you? Hey, good thank you. It's good, that's good. Now uh, for everyone that doesn't really know much about your music, can you give us a little rundown where it all started and what you're all about? Uh, sure, so um, it started in my bedroom with my MPC Lola who's a music production centre and we um, started making what we call electric blue witch hop which is um, beats um, of a certain variety <laughs> that we like um, take samples of sounds and stuff and then record bass, drums, guitar, a whole mixture of things put into Lola and then I produce it. Is like this that. a genre you've made up or this is actually a genre? It's a genre that we've made up, it's, okay. we've coined it but I couldn't really um, ever think I couldn't really ever quite fit the music that we made into existing genres very easily when people would ask me, so I just came up with something that I feel... That works? Uh, yeah. And it does, and uh, you can sample any type of thing, like I've heard Anything. cutlery drawers, um, yeah. a lamp, what's probably yeah. the buzziest thing you've ever sampled? Oh, um, <laughs> probably my afro comb scraping against my mirror, it makes oh a really good sound, but like, I don't think people would be able to identify it very easily yeah. if they heard it, yeah. So with most of your songs you can't probably listen to it and go, okay, that is definitely an afro <laughs> comb, we've got a cutlery <laughs> drawer there, it's yeah. not like that. No, no, not so much. See, the cutlery drawer does sound quite a lot like a cutlery drawer if you do get into opening and closing cutlery drawers. Okay, Just okay. Yeah. What's coming up in the pipeline for you? Are you working on an album? I've heard of some remixing on our Patchwork yes. Soldier. Yes, yeah. So, um, so what's coming up in the pipeline is um, there is a remix album coming out later in the awesome. year. My album um, that I released last year in April 2014 is also being re-released. It's called Esther, okay. self-titled. Yep. Um, that's being re-released um, on iTunes and Spotify on the 6th of March and it's being released by my record label in Paris today. So your your record label's um, in Paris? Yes. In yep. France? Yes. So how does that work? I mean you're a New Zealand based here, yeah. how come would it be easy enough for you to just go over there and, and start out with music there or? Um, so they're essentially doing Europe territory for me so um, they're um, distributing the album in that area and then in New Zealand I don't have a label okay. so it's an in independent release over here so I'm going to be going over to Europe and doing shows and kind of That's awesome, that's exactly there. what you want. Yeah it's really exciting, I'm yeah. really stoked. Yeah. What shows are coming up then, festivals and stuff that you're playing? Obviously Jim Beam Homegrown this weekend. Yes, Homegrown this yep. weekend which I'm really excited about mm -hmm. that's um, on the locally source stage at 3.45. Exact time yeah. and everything. Yep and um, and then I've got some other festivals coming up I'm playing WOMAD. Cool. Um, and yeah then I've got some solo shows coming up in April. Cool so they can get all the details from your Facebook page basically. Yes yeah all the details. Cool will so the Jim Beam page. Homegrown this weekend. Uh, tickets sadly already sold out but if you are going you need to watch this bird. <laughs> she is original unique and someone you Thank need you. to definitely watch on the locally sourced stage. Yeah locally sourced. Cool okay we're now going to roll into a track from you. This is a live version of uh, a single that has been remixed already. Yeah. This is Patchwork Soldier. <laughs> 